Hey, it's Candace again. And Joel with Torque Lift International. Today we're going to show you how to install our Glow Guide handrail. It works with any truck camper scissor step application and it glows in the dark for up to 10 hours with just a few minutes of light. It's a great safety addition for children and adults that have a rough time getting in and out of the truck camper. So what's our first step? As you can see, we have mocked our Glow Guide into position to determine the step mounting bracket. Now that we have determined the exact location for our step bracket, you will need to remove this bolt and this bolt. So we just finished attaching the step bracket. Now we need to determine where the upper tubing clip goes. As a general rule of thumb, it's 36 inches from the floor. We highly recommend actually stepping into an RV unit, placing the handle where it's most comfortable for you. Dennis? And that feels right. <clears throat> when mounting your tubing clip, you always want to be attached to a solid structure. Rule of thumb is the door frame will extend one inch past the weather strip. I'll make my mark. And now remove the glow guide. I'm gonna place my tubing clip up against my mark. Using a double back sticky tape. And drill out my holes. Next step, you will want to add some caulking to prevent any leaks. Screw it down. So as you can see, we have placed the lower arm through the step mount. We've placed the upper arm through our upper tubing clip and we've pinned it. Next, we need to determine where we're gonna put our strut arm. So how do we do that? First thing you're gonna to wanna to do is you wanna snug down your lower arm, snug down your upper arm, and find a comfortable position for the strut arm tubing clip. As you can see, we have a heavy duty bumper and kick panel, and so we have a couple different options for mounting. As long as you have a solid structure, you can really go anywhere. But for today's application, we'll be going to the kick panel. After determining the location for your strut arm tubing clip, remove double back sticky tape cover and place it against the location desired. You will then remove your clip and swing the strut arm out of the way. Next, you will fill your holes. and install your screws. You'll next, grab your strut arm, place it back in the tubing clip. Put your pin through. So we just finished the installation and this looks like a handrail, but just how sturdy is it? This thing is rock solid. Wow, Joel is shaking the entire truck camper with just a handrail. Why don't you give it a shot? You know, I've heard horror stories about people falling down their steps before, but with this, I just don't see how it could happen. That's much more safe. 
So it's really easy for us to set up and remove the glow guide, but how do we keep it from disappearing? Well, Candice, we have a lock as an accessory. They're very easy to install. Just pop your clip, remove it, slide your lock to the tubing clip, turn your key, and that's it. So now you're getting ready to leave the campsite and Joel is going to show us how to remove the glow guide and how to store it. First thing you're going to want to do, break the glow guide system down completely. The glow guide comes with two extra tubing clips, so this thing can be mounted literally anywhere. For today's installation, we'll be mounting to the back of the camper for ease of use and deployment. As you can see, I have reclipped my glow guide back into my upper tubing clip. You want to locate the first of your extra tubing clips and attach the Velcro to the back side. This tubing clip will run vertical with the upper tubing clip in between the two rubber handles. Remove the backing, press it up against the door frame, and remove your glow guide. Next step, grab your second tubing clip, move your Velcro out of the way, and press it right up against the first one. Now it's time to drill. Next we're going to add some silicone to the holes to keep out the water. Now, add your screws. So now that we have the glow guide stored, how easy is it to deploy? Very simple. That's it. Another unique feature about the glow guide is that it also works as a wash brush. It does. Extend your glow guide out, tighten the knee joint, pop the rubber cap off, attach the brush. And have at it. And so as you can see, the Glow Guide extends high enough to get to those hard to reach places. For more information about the Glow Guide handrail, visit us at torquelift.com or 1-800-246-8132.